The reports are swirling around after three sources with a Trump connection spoke to Axios and claimed that President Trump said that he is saving a seat on the Supreme Court for conservative judge Amy Barrett and that she will replace Justice Ruth Bader Ginsburg when the time comes. Last year when Justice Anthony Kennedy retired, 47-year-old Barrett was on Trump's shortlist and was considered a standout favorite by many conservative activists. Ultimately, that seat was filled by Brent Kavanaugh, who was nominated and came under intense scrutiny over previous abortion comments and multiple accounts of alleged sexual misconduct. Eventually and to the dismay of many, he was confirmed. Barrett was nominated in 2017 by President Trump to serve as a judge in the Seventh Circuit Court of Appeals. Has a long history of extremely conservative views, particularly surrounding abortion, which continues to trouble Dems. Barrett, a Notre Dame, is a past member of the University Faculty for Life, which is a group that promotes the anti-abortion movement in every way. She has been on record at of University magazine saying, life begins at conception, and has written about her willingness to revisit the landmark Roe v. Wade case. During a very tense confirmation hearing for her current position, Barrett was questioned by House Dems on the possibility of how her personal faith might hinder her ability to perform the duties of her job. Senator Dianne Feinstein, D. Califf famously said to Barrett during the hearing. Dot the dogma lives loudly within you, that's of concern. Dot Senator Dianne Feinstein to Judge Amy Barrett during her confirmation hearing in 2017. Although Trump has heartily expressed his desire to have Barrett on the bench which would allow for a serious conservative majority in the United States Supreme Court, the beautiful part of the whole thing is that the notorious Ruth Bader Ginsburg, now 85, is still going. Despite some recent health concerns, RBG is in good shape and has said she has every intent to keep going for at least five more years which would not give Mr. Trump much of a chance to save a seat for anyone.